Today we are discussing the CCNA based interview questions and answers for Cisco Data Center Core Technologies DCCOR. You can download the complete list of CCNA based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on DCCOR is how does the Cisco Nexus 9500 series switch contribute to high performance, high density data center networking? And what are its key features? Your answer should be the Nexus 9500 series switch is designed for high performance, high density data center networking. It supports a modular chassis with line cards offering various port densities and speeds. Key features include support for large-scale layer 2 and layer 3 deployments, high bandwidth and a non-blocking architecture. Our next interview question is explain the purpose of the Cisco Unified fabric feature and how it enables the convergence of storage and data networking in a data center environment. Your answer should be unified fabric refers to the convergence of storage and data networking onto a single infrastructure. Cisco unified fabric often implemented through technologies like FCOE, that is fiber channel over Ethernet, allows Ethernet networks to carry both data and storage traffic. This convergence simplifies the network architecture and reduces the need for separate networks for data and storage. Our next interview question is What is the Cisco Nexus 1000 V series switch and how does it enhance virtual machine networking in VMware environments? Your answer should be The Cisco Nexus 1000 V is a virtual switch designed for VMware environments. It extends Cisco's networking capabilities to virtualized servers. Providing advanced networking features, policy enforcement, and visibility for virtual machines. It enhances virtual machine networking in VMware environments by bringing familiar networking concepts to the virtualized infrastructure. Our next interview question is. How does the Cisco Application Policy Infrastructure Controller APIC contribute to the automation and orchestration of policies in a Cisco ACI environment? Your answer should be the Cisco APIC servers serves as the centralized policy controller in an ACI environment. It plays a crucial role in automating and orchestrating policies by providing a single point of management. The APIC allows administrators to define and enforce policies that govern the behavior of the entire data center network, promoting agility and consistency. Our next interview question is explain the benefits of implementing Cisco ACI multi-site and how it supports the deployment and management of policies across geographically distributed data centers. Your answer should be Cisco ACI multi-site enables the extension of ACI policies across multiple data center sites. This brings benefits such as consistent policy enforcement, 
workload mobility and simplified management across geographically distributed data centers. It allows organizations to maintain a unified policy framework while addressing the needs of a distributed infrastructure. If you are preparing for any Cisco based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below.